man. Okay. Uh, I need a car. Well, here we go. We're in Laufenberg. Uh, we've been cycling for two or three hours. <laughs> People are still on their own. And it's beer o'clock, so we've got a new beer here. So, can't pronounce it. I'm sure someone who's German or can speak German will be able to figure it out. Um, so, yeah, we'll take off again and we're very near, very near this time. Out. We're heading towards Koblenz. Koblenz, of course. There's two Koblenzes. Koblenz. Oh, We've been to both over the years, but one's in Germany, <laughs> on the Rhine, and one in Switzerland, also on the Rhine. Confusion. Confusion say I. Confusion say I. Okay, that's enough. Then. Bye. We'll have our beer and enjoy it. Well, this is wonderful. Look, we just stopped in a little cafe right on the Rhine, which uh, Anne previously took some nice photographs and video of. And we're sitting underneath the shade of the trees. It is overcast and cool, but it's it's very comfortable. And don't they do things so well <laughs> in Germany and Switzerland and France? And you've got water to cool down your coffee if it's too hot. <laughs> you giving you a little satchel of sugar, sugar, Ooh. biscuit, Ooh. and spring. Spring, very nice. <laughs> Beautiful latte. <laughs> On that note. Mm. Let's see enjoy it. <laughs> well, here we go. We're leaving Loffenburg and we're crossing that bridge. So we're leaving Switzerland and going to Germany in a few minutes. And I'm not sure what that place is called. <laughs> we'll find out once we cross the bridge. We're just at the top of a very steep hill, so I'm panting. And I just came across these pe peony rows and they are magnificent. And so this is for you, Chris and Charles Beamish. You gave me one and I am unable to grow anything like yours. These are beautiful. The rest of the garden here is just being planted for summer. Here's a little polytunnel. Tomatoes going in, ready to be planted. Nearly. Onions, so. potatoes, leaks. beans over there. Yeah, over here, oh, so in Tasmania we've left the autumn. So coming over here, it's amazing. We've got the spring. Oh yeah, it looks a bit sick actually. Yeah. Okay. Oh, look at the lovely blue irises. Fantastic. Alongside, and they've got a, a beautiful pond there. Absolutely chock full of water lilies, which are setting flowers now. And we've got a couple of dead ducks on the water there. <laughs> They're not moving anyway. I don't know how long they've been dead, but oh, look the male the, and the female. Look at the colour of that. Beautiful there. garden. Wow. Look. They've made every use of the. Uh, of the land. Yeah. Chock full of plants. In the back they've got a, a insect hotel. Oh, I didn't see that. Where yeah, is it's that? right over at the back there. Oh, way, 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 way up, yeah. Nest boxes in the trees. Yeah. Cherry trees got Bird a couple houses. of nest boxes. Bird houses. Nest boxes. Perfect. A bit of bamboo going on there, right? Yeah, huh? very thin. Lovely. Hazelnut trees. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, we've just come across a, a large canal here, it's huge, and it's, it looks like it's feeding into the Rhine, but um, we're not sure the name, it's, I think it's F-A-H-R Canal, I'm not sure how you would pronounce that, anyway, <laughs> enough said. It's about three o'clock in the afternoon, slightly getting a little bit darker. Not very sunny day today. Here's Al's on, on his bike. Uh, looking forward to <laughs> compliments. I don't know when we'll ever get there, but... <laughs> and look at the reflection there. Beautiful. A couple of swans. Back into Switzerland. We're going back into Switzerland, yep. Border control. Germany, Switzerland. 
and a big security <laughs> deadlock. <laughs> Keep out the riffraff. A little man-made beach on the side of the Rhine. Just called down here for a few minutes just to check it out. Beautiful serene shot of the Rhine. It's about four, five o'clock in the afternoon. So we're on the usual hunt for accommodation, campsite, whatever. And alongside the Rhine is this huge chimney. <laughs> and another. Al's just found her overnight accommodation <laughs> right next door to that. <laughs> oh, good. to another little village and uh, we were checking out the cattle that are being fed up there all very contented chewing away and now we're just looking at this beautiful house behind everything's spotless we're wishing well i'm wishing well unusual yeah, looks like it's wear wearing a mexican hat <laughs> <laughs> and then they've got crows in the garage nice garden out the back that you can yeah so they haven't let the cattle out yet which is oh. uh, surprising Huge bridge. Here we are. It's quarter to nine at night and we still have no accommodation. Just pulled into a hotel. Totally booked out. So it is while camping. So in order to go wild camping, we had to have a beer. And this is a beautiful tennis club. I, I can't really get the view of part of it. Clay, clay courts? Clay courts? Fabulous restaurant. Ooh. And I am um, just lovely. Oh, absolutely beautiful. So here we are. <laughs> the last beer is just to... Oh. And it's supposed to rain, so we'll test the tent tonight. <laughs> this is just giving us, I don't know what's this giving us the beer, Al. It's just giving us a bit of Dutch courage, I suppose, to I might go find a way. And we might edit a video <laughs> and have it up for you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs>